Yeah, hi and welcome to new tournament channel today we will discuss about material determination configuration and process in this class okay uh, material determination we can call as a material substitution generally sometimes uh, material is expired uh, instead of that material a new material can be uh, introduced in this case uh, users uh, generally they are entering old material to avoid these mistakes okay we can we can uh, configure material determination okay whenever they enter old material system can replace uh, with the new material here is two types one is uh, directly system can replace new material sometimes it will show it will show uh, uh, it will pop up display okay uh, if they want to enter a new material they can enter uh, otherwise if they can close they can use old material also if there is some uh, remaining stock is there they need to sell that purpose we can use i will show you both the process process in this class okay uh, if you like my video please uh, please subscribe my channel and don't forget to like and share to your friends okay if you have if you want any help you can uh, you can comment in my comment box okay mm. First, I will explain you configuration. SPRO, SAP Reference IMG, Sales and Distribution, Basic Functions, Material Determination, Maintain Prerequisites for Material Determination. Here we can maintain condition tables. Okay, first step. Okay, create condition table. Display change if if you want to change, you can change already existing. Display just you can see. Create means you can see create. Just like pricing condition tables, we can create uh, condition tables here. Zero zero one zero zero two already uh, and uh, available. Generally, we can use uh, this thing only. I will show you. Uh, if you want to create a new condition uh, uh, tables, you can end, uh, you can use from five hundred to triple nine. You can create. Okay. Um. I will show you in change. Okay. One display here. Technical view. I have used material. Okay. M A T W A. Okay. It is enough. Okay. If you want to go with the two. Sales organization, distribution channel, and material intent. Okay, generally we can use these three combinations. Okay, come back. Once the condition tables created, okay, uh, you can uh, you can maintain uh, those condition tables in access sequence level. Any access sequence material entered. Okay, click here. Accesses whatever accesses are there if you want to see fields you can see fields if you want to create new you can create new already uh, already several topics i have explained like uh, uh, pricing uh, pricing and uh, uh, pricing pricing topic is there pricing uh, video is there you can check how to create condition tables access sequence these things just like you can use here okay um nothing uh, different here okay you can create it if you want to go new entries so go to new entries create a new access sequence here go to new entries create new access sequence okay then that new access click here okay go to new entries enter your condition tables so then you can do field mapping x click here double click here okay it will ask you can enter field mapping will come okay like that you can maintain access sequence okay these access sequence you can maintain in, in your condition type depend condition type here just to go to new entries you can create uh you can create a new condition type z001 or z002 whatever you want okay you can assign access sequence that's it there is nothing if you can double click nothing just you can create one condition type that is uh, material determination condition type and you can maintain access sequence okay after that as it is uh, pricing uh, maintain uh, material determination procedure here okay you can create any new procedure if you want otherwise you can use existing okay existing there whatever you have created condition type that condition type you can use i hope i have created this one okay here i have used my condition type okay here requirement is there some routines you can maintain if you want otherwise not required okay just you can maintain and you can use it okay 
then these all are major prerequisites okay after that assign pricing procedure to sales document uh, assign uh, material determination procedure to sales document uh, just click here whatever uh, you are using that or whatever you have created uh, the document type for the document you can assign material determination procedure okay once procedure is assigned here uh, most important step define substitution reasons okay substitution reason means here if we can use all zeros or anything okay uh, anything here strategy field is there if you here two types are automatic substitute products are displayed for selection that means display okay it will come pop up we can select okay general material determination with selection without atp okay generally we can use these both i'm uh, first i'm using automatic okay automatic after that uh, we will come here okay after that we can put a we can check okay so now this is the configuration most important configuration in material determination okay now now we can maintain condition record okay now you can maintain condition records come back in easy access screen okay logistics sales and distribution master data products material determination vb11 to create condition records for material determination okay here i have used a zero zero one for material determination okay you can enter your uh, old material here you, which one you want to replace here you can enter here here substitution reason suppose if you can e you can use substitution reason here so there is uh, several material replacement material you can use it will applicable for all otherwise we can here we i am using four zeros okay reason okay this reason well can applicable here okay save it and now i am going to create va01 or va02 purchase order number date pivot date I'm uh, my old material is m slash 06 10 quant I'm using see I'm entering automatically system can redirect to m slash 08 you can say m slash 08 redirected why because substitution reason slash o spro we have used automatic okay that means system cannot give you uh, option to select okay spro sap reference img sales and distribution basic functions material determination depends substitution reasons here i have maintained strategy as okay you, uh, automatic because our system replaced new material instead of old material i am putting a here okay okay i am creating new sales order now slash n v a zero one why i am using slash and va01 system can replace that screen that purpose i am using otherwise it will uh, adapt for old configuration so you need to use slash and va01 to adapt uh, to get a new configuration see i am putting m slash 06 here substitution reason i have changed there system can do pop up um, this product is changed you want to continue with uh, new material or not if we can put okay system can take new material otherwise you can close we can sell old material why this option we can use still this material is closed that version is closed new material came still we have some uh, availability stock is there plus per old material m slash 06 in this case we can 
click and cancel otherwise you can click it m slash 08 will come see one more material i am entering same material okay can quantity again system can give pop up you can close it it will allow to sell old material itself see item over your screen level we can check maximum see it will allow for that purpose we can use pop up okay Yeah, this is a material determination, uh, configuration, condition records and uh, class. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel Neutral Mints. Don't forget to comment, like and share to your friends. Okay, you will get more videos on SAP SD. Thank you.